uh, hello friend today we will discuss about cloud computing so in this topic I have made some point here we will discuss uh, in this video only so and, and another point I have here like uh, uh, Azure uh, like here also I have mentioned some point these points need uh, we will discuss uh, in this chapter in this in this session only and last we'll discuss about the uh, career in cloud let's talk about what exactly the cloud computing so cloud is just a uh, metaphor for the internet when we say cloud we are just referring to the internet so why it's a metaphor because uh, everyone when about a baby so he or she also use the internet right so that means he or she also use the cloud because i can give an example to more understanding why it is just a metaphor for the internet uh, like uh, uh, we are using you know uh, there are the so many uh, mailing services service service providers are there right like uh, gmail and yahoo and um, hotmail and google drive there are a lot of services are there right every time we are using right day every day so when we're sending the some mails and receiving the mail that should not be stored in your local drive local computer it should be stored in where over the internet right somewhere it is stored but it's not in local it should be stored over the internet and they uh, they uh, whoever the provider the service provider they have created their infrastructure they have the server so that is stored where it is over the stored in internet that's what it's just a metaphor for the internet so it's a cloud simple it's a cloud when we say cloud we are just referring to the internet okay in the simplest term the like cloud computing means uh, storing and accessing data and program over the internet instead of other local drive hard drive okay so we are not supposed to stay in the cloud computing we are not supposed to store the our data in the local drive it should be stored in the uh, cloud in the internet of uh, in other uh, you know infrastructure over the internet okay and the third point cloud computing refer to a variety of service it's not a single service because uh, the customer might be required uh, he should want as per the requirement right if i want some server so i i ask the service provider i need some servers if i need some applications so i want to some use some application i need please provide some applications to use if i need storage then i will ask for the storage so there are the variety of services are there as per the requirement the customer can want and and the service provider will deliver the computing functionality to their uh, because uh, they have their own infrastructure uh, they have their own data center and somewhere uh, we just want uh, we just ask him to provide the services that's it they will provide the service we are not going to purchase in hardware software everything we just you know um, pay the money for the services only that they will provide we are not going to maintain or we are not going to uh, install the updates we are not going to update the antivirus for the you know security purpose purpose okay and the fourth point cloud platform hide the complexity why it's hide the complexity the reason i told you right in the earlier days uh, every organization have their own data center and they have purchased their hardware like servers storage you know they need to install the os and every time and every month they need to uh, patching the security patches as, as for the vulnerability perspective you know security perspective and uh, for the data you know uh, for the data security they must be updated the antivirus every time and they they should monitor all these things and they uh, you know they recruit the engineer to do all things okay this is very cost cutting and very complexity but in cloud nothing they will provide everything they will provide services you just use the application you just use uh, you know the things they will maintain everything no need to worry about it and it's, it's, it's a cost cutting also right okay so it's a it's, it's like a cloud for a platform uh, hide the complexity and details uh, uh, of the underlying infrastructure and from user application by providing very simple graphical interface if you want graphical interface and api that application program interface also you can use i mean simple you will open you will uh, you know you, you need to internet only and open the browser and access the url that's it you will get everything simple way and the cloud platform provides on-demand services means see anywhere always on anytime any place wherever you want you can access your server access uh, you know you get the services but if you have own organization you have their own data so you cannot access from outside if you want you have to vpn connection then you know connect your vpn uh, from non-corporate network to corporate network and you will access 
right this is a lot of things headaches but here and you, you know and some sometimes you like um, uh, for the weekend you for the maintenance you have to shut down restart everything right but in cloud nothing every time it should be on always on anywhere anytime any place and the load balancing everything your data never be lost you never be lost your data it's more secure that's the reason it's provides demand services that are always on and why are the business moving to cloud I explain all these things because of this reason the business uh, want to move to cloud because I explain here also like in addition hosting a software company has to deal with the licensing cost definitely if you have their own data center if you own up licensing cost and protection of data and frequent upgrade and latest technology maintenance and upgrade hardware most important finding the right skill set at the right time you have to do it but everything is doing by the service provider so you should not be worried about it your data your infrastructure your technology they will update everything so this is what everyone is moving every business want to moving to the cloud so that's all uh, friends uh, in the next session we will you know uh, discuss about the cloud characteristics so uh thank you bye bye thanks for watching this video and do not forget to subscribe my channel uh because of that if you don't subscribe so i my channel won't be grow so i need your help to subscribe my channel like and comment thanks thank you very much